Okay! <laughs> he brought Persian. Uh, BBR season finale. We're taking on In Vivid Color, coach of the South Texas Sable Eyes. If you guys are excited for today's BBR Wi Fi battle, make sure to like button and subscribe button down below. He didn't bring Dragonite. He brought Toad's Cruel. He brought Persian. Why? Oh, God. Okay. So if you've not keep been keeping up with our BBR run as a whole, I need to win this game to make playoffs because I fumbled the bag against Shay and I fumbled the bag against Q. Vivid is a must win. Um, if I don't win, I have to lose 2-0 or 1-0. Um, he didn't bring the scary Pokemon, which is concerning because they're scary for a reason. Um, so yeah, that's where my life's currently at. He brought Terra Persian. He has a Dragonite that literally just did it better. And I know Delray is sitting there laughing in his stupid fucking chair because he's like, he's going to bring Persian against you. And I said, no, he's not because he's a Dragonite. And now he's going to be fucking giggling like a little child when they get Girl Scout cookies. He also brought Iron Thorns. He didn't bring... There's something else he didn't bring that I was insanely scared of. Um, Annihilate! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, there's no Eliolate. There's no Eliolate. There's no Annihilate. There's no fucking Clodsire either, I don't think. I didn't even write down his team, bro. Um, so good luck, fun of Vivid. Make sure you guys go check him out. Um, he brought Cerulege. He brought Persian. He brought Iron Thorns. He brought Iron Bundle. Um, he brought Grim Snarl. What's up, dude? And. Did he bring Claude Sire? Did he bring Claude Sire? Check status? No, check target? Plus? Uh, he brought Toad Scroll, so he didn't even bring Claude Sire either. Dude, he brought nothing I was scared of, which makes me even more scared, because I don't know what to do! <laughs> uh, we're just gonna spore. We want to deny screens as much as possible. Um, I'm faster than No Speed Grimmsnarl. If he's really fast for some reason, then I guess that's cool. He is just going to parting shot with the prankster something's going sleepy by which works for me because there's no screen up uh he could go into toad scroll i guess yeah yeah it's toad scroll it's gonna be toad scroll it's gonna be toad scroll yep there it is all right uh, <sighs> well, like what does this thing do like it gets sludge bomb and that's an issue because i can't sword stance on it um he's not sporing here though like that's a given that's a given. And if he does spore, Corviknight's fine to take it. So I'm gonna Corviknight. And if he ha sets up hazards, at least I have defog. Uh, my mind is completely shooketh. Um, because this is nothing that I expected whatsoever. So now I'm just like, I don't know how to play Pokemon. My brain hurts. Uh, as we do see a spore. Tough. Tough, tough, tough. But, like, what does this do to me? It's either spiking or doubling into Cerulege, right? Right? That just makes sense. It's a spike or a Cerulege play. Withdraws into Cerulege. Okay. Uh, Chen Pao guaranteed Oko's this thing with Sucker Punch. Like, 100%, no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Um, Saru Ledge. Yeah, this thing is gone. So, on a switch out... I really want to crunch. I really do. I really want to crunch. Because it gets me more damage. But I want to sucker punch. Because in case he is a Scarf Saru Ledge, this could be really bad. But, like, he doesn't stay in here. He doesn't. I'm going to kick myself. He stayed in. Now I'm concerned. Now I feel like I fucked up. I feel like I fucked up. Sash? No, he just hacked it. Okay. <laughs> Bro, you can't be making plays like that. It plays with my heart. It plays with my heart. I'm not mentally okay to deal with things like that. Oh, jeez. In comes the Persian. Why are you here? Where's the Dragonite, dude? Why are you here? Going into Diablo, I'm gonna try and burn sleep turns and make this thing take a Rocky Helmet. Why are you here, you stupid cat? 
Why are you here? What are you going to do? I guess knocking off my helmet's bad, but the helmet's here for Dragonite, so like, I don't... I don't know, I don't know, I just don't know. My brain hurts, I simply do not know. He's going to trash terrorize. So he's tearing a normal cat, but like, that's fine. Yeah, like this is fine. Big ass head over here. That actually looks kind of clean on Persian, to be fair. Um, but like, what do you fake out? That's fine. We'll just munch on that real quick. Oh, ow, that did it. That actually moved my health bar. That was impressive. Good job, Persian. You did you did a good job. And his life orb. Oh, look at you go. Look at you go. Let me you turn. Look at you go, big dog. Look at you go, big fella. I've decided you can't do any damage to me. I've just simply decided. Yeah, I've decided that you can't do any damage because you're a Persian. Into Grimmsnarl. This is my check to Grimmsnarl. I don't why. <laughs> Por qué? I, I, I'm here to check you. Why did you bring this one in? I'm going to... I really want to defog on his screen. Um. Oh, well, looks like I'm defogging. <laughs> I... Oh, why? <laughs> okay! So we're back. Fucking Corviknight decided to take him a little long nap skis, so we had to click reflect a couple times, but that's okay. I kind of just want a Brave Bird, to be honest. I'm gonna parting shot. I should have U-turned. He doesn't have a screen up anymore. So, like, that's fine. This is okay chip on anything. It's probably thorns. It's probably thorns here. But if he goes thorns, that's not a big deal. Toad's... Sir, 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 that did a lot. Sir, you don't resist that move. What the fuck? Oh, I thought he was weakness policy. <laughs> I was gonna say, hold up, wait a minute. Uh, does Breloom kill with Mach Punch from here? Should kill. So I'm gonna switch Breloom on a potential score because he's not gonna sludge bomb or anything like that. So I'll make the Breloom play here. If he sludge bombs, that's just a good predict, but I'll live one, so it's fine. He does spore. So now that Breloom's back in, I can mock punch this thing and get rid of anything he wants to do. I'm just gonna click it. Mock punch! Yep, nice, nice! Let's go! Alright, so the Toad's Cruel is gone, the Breloom Sash is intact, Cerula, we're, oh my god. We're looking fine right now, we're looking gorgeous, looking gorgeous. Back in a Persian. What's up, Persian? How you doing? What's up, cat? You ain't gonna believe what I'm gonna do this turn. You guys are not going to believe the Oh, he made a double. He making the double. Oh, he making the double. I really wanted to double Gengar there, too. I felt like Gengar was such a good play there. Oh, he got the quirky drive. He got the quirky drive. He boosted his attack. Okay. Um, As long as Braylon has its sash intact, it's fine. Because this, this bullet seed... Well, Bullet Seed into Mach will always get rid of this thing. No questions asked. So, I kind of want to... Who's more important, Haxorus or Gengar? Because I kind of want to make an aggressive double into one of my Scarfers. I don't think it matters, to be honest. But I like Haxorus. Well, I like Gengar as a nuke to bundle, which is more important. I'm going to make the aggressive Haxorus also because I can Earthquake instead of Focus Blasting with Gengar. Um, yeah, because a Thunder Punch could come out here, and if it does, it's fine. Um, a Stone Edge could hurt, but that's fine. I think Gengar is the smarter choice as a Scarf. He does DD, so he did get the attack boost, though, so we are faster. If he Sash, I just Revenge with Breloom. So we are big chilling. We are bing chilling, as the kids would say. We are going to Earthquake. We are going to remove of the Thornsy Mans. You cannot Terra because you terra your cat. If you withdraw, you ain't got a ground resist, so that's cool with me. And I'm Earthquake! Wow, you make my R of quake. Later, loser. Back, you used, you just got killed by your replacement, bro. How does that feel? Damn, dude, that's tough. You really just got killed by your replacement, dude. Oh, dude, that, that I feel bad. That was BM. That's BM on Iron Thorns, bro. That's BM. <laughs> that's BM on Iron Thorns. That's tough. That is unfortunate for our friend there. Oh, it's this song. I love this song. He gonna recollect. How about no? 
Um, I don't need to. I can just U-turn. If he stays in, I have Gengar to just click Sludge Bomb until the cows come home. He does parting shot, so I get the slow momentum here. Which is fine. I also have Breloom with Sash to, uh, just fucking kill something next turn. We are looking mighty fine. I'm also just vibing right now. I'm having a good time. Into the Belly Derb. Hello, Belly Derb. Um, you have no Spadef, right? So Gengar is the correct play here. Uh, you have no Spadef, Sludge Bomb, guaranteed kills after that U-turn damage. So I get to find out if you're Scarf, Belly Derb. Hey, 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 That didn't matter. I refuse to believe it did. Um, I think we win, boys. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the slump is over. I don't slump. I pee moles, bro. I pee moles all over this bitch. I pee moles all over everyone. I pee moles everywhere. He hasn't had a flight screen. That makes me think he might have sucker punch. He might have sucker punch. I don't need the diff, but I also am not. I'm not trying to throw this away. I'm not trying to throw this away being an idiot. I'm not trying to throw this away like an idiot. He does have light screen, so we probably don't sucker punch then. Um, yeah, okay, that's fine. I'm just gonna roost because he doesn't beat Corviknight. Corviknight do be winning the game here. GG's. Yeah, he called it early. GG's. Um, if he runs, that's fine. Like, obviously, I want to play the game out, but this game also goes really long, so it's fine if he wants to just run. <laughs> Uh, he doesn't beat Corviknight in any universe. I'm just gonna U-turn back into Gengar and claim another kill. I'm going to Roost and then Defog and then U-turn and then go into Gengar and win. So, that should be fine. Uh, I'm gonna Defog, so that way the thing's gone. And then I'm gonna U-turn into Gengar. He's gonna fake me out, which is gonna stall another turn as well. Trailblaze. Oh, okay. So you're just gonna do that then. You're just gonna be that guy, so I can't revenge you with Gengar, you dick. Fucking Persian over here. Fucking Rocky Helmet Life War Persian being a dickhead over here. Fucking dude guy. We're going to defog the light screen away. Um, and that was a U-turn into Breloom. For Breloom. Actually, I'm going to get Chen Pao kills. Yeah, we're going to get Chen Pao kills. I've decided. I want Chen Pao kills. <laughs> Thief! What the? What the? I want Chen Pao kills. Please give me Chen Pao kills. <laughs> Wait, don't kill him. No! No! <laughs> Damn it, Corviknight. You stupid bitch. You dumb fuck. You fucked it up, you idiot. <laughs> God damn it. I wanted Chen Pao kills, you dick. Uh, I'm just gonna Gengar and Sludge Bomb. Is there any other play? What? I don't... I can't lose this. I don't think he gets Sucker Punch, so I'm just gonna Gengar and Sludge Bomb. <laughs> we'll get Gengar kills, because I think Reflect is worse for me in the long run. I don't know. I can't lose this. I'm up 6-1, six, uh, six so like, <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. I'm going to play for Gengar kills and play a little bit reckless. We have already met all the rec- Oh, he didn't even light screen. Give me the Gengar kill. Yes! Oh, Gengar! We already met the requisitions for making playoffs, baby. That is a 6-0 dub against Vivid. Huge GG's to Vivid. Um, like I said, I don't slump. I pee moles. I pee moles all over this bitch. So we turn this shit around, and we are making the playoff run, boys. So if you guys enjoyed today's Wi Fi battle, make sure to like button and subscribe button down below. On left hand side, I'll be a YouTube video recommended for you. And on the right hand side, I'll be some more of our BBR Season 4 playlist. If you haven't checked it out already. So with that, I'm gonna get out of here. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Colonel. See you guys next time. Peace. I'm out. Bye.